guys, it's Queen DJ, and in today's video, I will be reacting to episode 21 of season 4 of My Hero Academia. So let's go ahead and get started in 3, 2, 1, go. There's always two. <laughs> mm -hmm. If you have to, just imagine, you know, their pumpkins or their underwear. I don't know, their nudes. I don't know. Do you have any actor role? <laughs> yeah, it could break and you could fall and really hurt yourself. back in time.
Mega. <laughs> Man, what the fuck? <laughs> well, damn. <laughs> I can't. You have. Mm -hmm. Just go ahead and walk away. Too late, he already realizes. And also, it's the perfect time. Mm -hmm.
are taken seriously. Oh. Oh, her run is so cute. No, it's so precious. You would think he would rhyme. You would just stand there, oh my god. <laughs>
behind you. They'd be on the internet. <laughs> A lot harder because you're around that. Besides, he's having too much fun with you, Zuko. The one time you just don't want someone to be there, I mean, Jesus. Now you're going to leave.
Mm-hmm. Of course, you've adopted. Honey, let's not because I'm not ready for this. <laughs> Oh, I'm not ready for my baby. The shine is gonna be so good. I mean, she's already shining no matter what because she's just an adorable little thing. But uh, I just remember like getting to this part, and no, I was like, "Hannah, wait, what the fuck is your cord?" And, like, I had so many questions, and I was just like, "I'm not gonna know." And then I got to the following week, but I'm not gonna talk about it because it's still spoilers in the line. But uh, I mean. In a way, and I kind of said this when I, when I was reading this chapter like two years ago, time is not on Izuku's side. In a way it is, but at the same time it's not. Everybody's getting ready and he's just MIA right now and nobody knows where the hell he is. And it's just like, if only they knew, but still. And that's why sometimes I wish instead of like, it just be Izuku and going out and going to get a rope. At least I kind of wish that he had someone to take with him. It could have been Todoroki. It could have been Ida. Someone who was also going to be able to help in the background. But still, missing one person is better than two. Because, I mean, when you're missing two people, that's, mm-mm, that's too much. When it's one, it's okay. One and done, you can probably find them quickly. Not as quick, but, I mean, seriously. That's one less person you got to worry about, too. That's too much. Mm-hmm. But my baby is gonna shine so you can I can't wait. The love that she has for Gentle is just, it's so fucking pure. And it's so adorable. And it's just, because at first, like, I didn't know how um, I relatively felt about her. Like, when she was first introduced and everything. Because I was like, I don't think I'm gonna, I don't think I'm, at the first I I kept saying, I don't think I'm gonna like her. I I think she's, like, different and yada yada but then the more when I kept reading and then I started loving her as a character and just learning the love and the backstory that these two have for each other especially the you know the love that she really it's intense for her and she really truly loves him with every fiber of her being of her being so I feel like if because mm, did they show it in the the next chapter. I think they did. I'm not 100% sure because, like I said, it's been two fucking years since I've read everything for it. Like, that's all that's happening in season four. Um, I think they're going to show her backstory of... They, well, because they've already shown the point where, like, yes, they they literally freaking met in the last episode. But I'm hoping that with next week, and I think it is next week's episode, they're going to show it, um, how she truly was before she met Jettle. And I think that is one of the best stories that I've seen for, like, as someone who is a side character, but she is put up in the front as much. But she's, it's just with her. No, I can't even say that yet. I have to wait until at least next week or the week after. So that's when I can say it. But I don't know. I mean, it's a damn good episode, and I can honestly cannot wait for her to show her quirk out to everybody because this was the one girl who I was like, what the fuck can she do? And then getting into the next chapter, I was like, oh, okay, oh shit. Because I wasn't, I couldn't believe it for a moment. I was like, oh, are you serious? Like, that's what it is? And they're like, okay, interesting. But yeah, I'm just, I'm excited and I'm nervous at the same time. But other than that, guys, that is my reaction review. to episode 21 of season four of My Hero Academia. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single day. Join the Metro Squad. And of course, I will see you guys for sure on next Saturday for episode 22. Bye, guys.